The U.S. Army Field Band Brass Quintet providing the soundtrack for yesterday's annual holiday tree lighting. Hello and welcome to Mead Week. I'm Brian Spann. More from the Installation Chapel later in the show. Also this week, EEO counselors are needed, the defense media activity to host a CFC kickoff, plus lots going on at MWR this holiday season. But first, we are well into that holiday season, and partly for that reason, December is designated as National Drunk, Drug, Driving, or 3D Prevention Month. At this year's Army Substance Abuse Program 3D Prevention Seminar, Program Manager Samson Robinson says party hosts should be extra wary. If you're a host, uh you know, you want to pay attention. You really pay attention to uh, people. It's hard to really tell, you know, because some people just have a very high tolerance. You know, so we always equate a person who is under the influence or, or a person that should not be driving, we always equate them to some type of physical characteristics that we see. Well, the problem is that mentally, you become mentally impaired way before you ever get an opportunity to become physically impaired because your BAC level, tolerance level for mental is much, much, much lower. Robinson added that it doesn't matter how many times you may have gotten away with it in the past. It's dry sober, you know, because there is a, a, a possibility. It doesn't mean, matter how many times you've done this. It doesn't matter how many times you have had this down, you have done this route, you have driven home under the influence. It only takes one time. Nearly 30 people die in the United States every day in motor vehicle crashes that involve an alcohol-impaired driver. In other news, the Fort Meade Equal Employment Opportunity Office is looking for candidates to serve as Department of the Army Certified Collateral Duty EEO Counselors. Counselors conduct inquiries into complaints of discrimination and work to resolve complaints at the lowest level. Supervisor approval is required, as well as a commitment to complete two cases per year. Nominations are due by January 31st. For more information, you can contact the EEO office. They're located at 4432 Llewellyn Avenue or call 301-677-6928. In other news, the annual Combined Federal Campaign is underway. The CFC is the world's largest annual workplace charity campaign. On Wednesday, December 12th, the Defense Media Activity is hosting a CFC kickoff event open to the entire Fort Meade community. We're inviting uh, all the tenant units here on uh, Fort Meade Garrison to come over to Defense Media Activity between 10 and 2 o'clock. Uh, our front parking lot of our building will be open for all guest visitors to come in through our front door, and then we're going to have 10 vendors in the lobby for them to interact with that are CFC partners, so that way they can get more information, find out about volunteer opportunities, and this will give uh, commands as well as our command the opportunity to reach that goal of 100% contact for CFC this year. Pierce adds that anyone eligible to contribute to CFC is welcome. It's a great opportunity for those smaller units, those tenant units that might not be able to do a big kickoff event because of not having the numbers or the space or the people. Please come on by. Our facility's here and you know we're just excited to allow everybody the opportunity to come over and uh, partner up with us. Once again, the DMA kickoff event is December 12th from 10 to 2. Meanwhile, we have some holiday reminders from MWR. This Christmas, Experience wonder like never before. Start your Christmas tradition today. MWR's Leisure Travel Services can take you to New York to see the Rockettes on Thursday, December 13th. The prize includes transportation and a ticket to the show. For more information, call Leisure Travel Services at 301-677-6354. Santa's Workshop is coming up on Saturday, December 15th from 10 a.m. to noon at the School Age Center 2 at 909 Ernie Pyle Street. Pre-registration is required. For more information, call 301-677-6054. We close the show with some scenes from last night's annual holiday tree lighting at the Installation Chapel. I'm Brian Spann. Join me on Mead Week next week for the annual Year in Review. For everyone at Mead TV and the Fort Mead Public Affairs Office, have a great weekend and a great Mead Week. The soldier rolled over and drifted to sleep. I couldn't control it. I continued to weep. I kept watch for hours so silent and still, and we both shivered from the cold night's chill. Then the soldier rolled over with a voice soft and pure, whispered, Carry on, Santa. It's Christmas Day. All is secure. Well, look at my watch, and I knew he was right. Merry Christmas, my friend. And to all, a good night. Oh.